I was asked the question, how do millennials change business and marketing? And I chose to really uh, focus on the marketing piece here because I um, was born and raised as a consumer marketer. I'm a corporate and brand citizenship uh, strategic communications advisor out of passion. And I always see sort of the marketing opportunity within um, the area of citizenship and sustainability. So what I've done here is I've put together um, some thoughts about um, what an answer to that question might look like. And I thought about marketing more from a creative standpoint because I think marketing today um, needs to be creative. Um, I would say in order to capture imagination and attention in a highly cluttered world, it needs to be epic creative uh, to really capture the millennial mindset. So how do we do that as marketers looking at the data from these 17 countries? Well, number one, I think we have to move the brand conversation within the area of citizenship from vague to precise. Um, I think I shared with you that 68% want brands to be more active in the problems we are facing. Um, and we know that they don't expect every industry to address every issue, only the issues that are relevant to their brand or their business. Um, and we also know that millennials expect brands to focus their efforts on where the brands can make an impact. Um, you know, if you're a health company, you should be focused on solving health issues, right? So that's as simple as it gets. Um, so where the brands can have an impact rather than what's important to millennials personally. Remember, they can separate that. So the implication as uh, we as marketers is that, you know, we have to have involvement in a micro, um, in a micro issue. It will certainly make it easier for a brand to focus messaging and creative. So we just have to get very narrow um, in the way that we market um, when it comes to citizenship and sustainability initiatives for the millennial mindset. Number two, interestingly enough, um, we presented this data on the stage at the Cannes Creative Festival in Cannes, France this year. We had some really powerful marketers from, from different brands on our panel having a discussion. And one of the things that came out of that was to understand that it's not my creative as a brand anymore. Um, it's our creative with millennials. That's the perception that needs to change for marketers around millennials is that this is a co-created, collaborative um, relationship that millennials want to have with brands. I'm not sure if anyone saw the fantastic work that came out of Australia around Dumb Ways to Die. Um, a, a really big winner last year, Tan, not this year, but last year, around keeping people safe on the tracks. Um, more specifically, those millennials or those younger people in Australia who are on their Blackberries or their iPhones walking into the train tracks. A lot of uh, injuries happening um, from distraction. Um, a big ad agency there created this powerful campaign called Dumb Ways to Die to change um, behavior with the younger generation. And they didn't, at the ad agency, do it on their own. They invited millennials in to co-create what that campaign looked like, and that's why you see a powerful campaign in Dumb Ways to Die. If you haven't seen it, look it up on the internet. It's fantastic work. So what we're saying by it's not the brand's creative anymore, it's our creative, and that we're saying that it needs to be co-created and collaborated with millennials, if millennials are certainly an important target. Um, we know that there is a direct correlation between millennials getting involved and their belief that they have a greater voice in driving change. Um, that is clear to us. 74% would be proud to be associated with a brand that they were perceived as doing the right thing, and almost half are looking to brands to provide simple ways for them to make a difference. The last one is, for marketers, is we need to rely on storytelling and refrain from bragging. Um, through our data, it was clear to us that 69% of millennials want more meaningful connections, and meaningful is the um, important word there, with people who share their dreams for the world. 79% um, wish it were easier to know which brands were doing good for society. So the implication, we believe, is that we as marketers need to tell our story to take millennials on a journey from idea to implementing change to more change. And it is no longer the before and after scenario. They want to go along with brands on the journey. They want moment, they want stories to be developed along the journey. They want to be part of the journey and they want to be part of telling those stories if they believe um, it is being done right.